He even had a throw kill back then. Yo, he did. That's yeah. <laughs> All right, so we're moving on straight in the semis, I believe. It was it's still quarter. It was still, still quarter. quarter. Yeah, yeah, we got a Poker Land slingshot, the number one seed showing off. I mean, why did the number one seed 3 0 in their round one? But slingshot, slingshot's pretty nice. Slingshot's got some. Got some dubious stuff, and Diddy Kong, man, this character has had a bit of a renaissance in COVID, looking a lot stronger uh, since a lot, not only with the buffs, but a lot of uh, a lot of upper name players, high level players, showing uh, trying to delve into that same meta game, learn some new stuff, or just revitalize some old stuff. And yeah, we see you Z drop banana. <laughs> yeah, no, Diddy Kong has had like a lot of changes ever since this game came out. Or that his character like on like day one I guess had like an infinite, <laughs> which yeah. is patched out, and then they just they just invented like a new one, <laughs> and that got patched out. <laughs> it's like stop. <laughs> but We're the kidding. character, yeah, the character is still solid because the game plan alone is just never gonna change. You can't make this character bad, in my opinion. Yeah, it's it's pretty interesting because they got rid of the infinite by buffing uh, Diddy Kong, like they made. Uh, they made certain changes overall uh, to Banana Pull and to things like uh, Fair uh, that made the character better from a like a neutral standpoint, but they also removed the infinite. So like, Ooh. hey, Just died mid stage. The axe out of shield. Good stuff there from Pokemon. Always stay strapped. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> now we're in the Pokelam game plan of like Lloyd is always there. <laughs> like <laughs> oh, some Lloyd? Come out. That's Lloyd, also a good please. chance for yeah, it's also a good chance for Slingshot to get it, because that's like where Village is most vulnerable when they pull out Lloyd. So it's all about positioning here and it's good stuff for Slingshot to get the out smash with that ceiling so high. Or the death right there. So I may have needed a little more damage or a little more rage in order to take that stock. They can do it again. That would be nice. It would would be good for him. Uh, he sprinkles the water, no plant nearby, but hey, he's watering the ground. Yeah, mind games, Pokemon, <laughs> Pokemon edition. <laughs> oh, oh, he high profiled it. He high profiled yeah. the down smash now. Uh, <laughs> this is a crazy exchange right now. Oh, <laughs> back and forth, back and forth. Oh. Little bit of spaghetti, but finally ends up taking the stock with that frame Crazy. five up smash. Axe on deck. Be careful, don't do stupid things. I'll chop you. Oh, the platform jab. Yeah, Pokemon like knows like when they go in and out with this character. So you when you see this character like coming with their disjoints or their kill moves or buttons, Pokemon is ready to, to, to catch it. Oh, nice to use the, the angling of the rockets in order to get past that that setup. Gotta make use of everything you got. Oh, the drift on Pokolam to go weave around this tree. Yeah. But Slingshot's being like very aware of so many of the setups that Pokolam's trying to trying to pull off that he's gone a solid couple minutes without Ooh. landing too much not getting too much damage on him. Yeah, he went from now nah, he's in a little bit of trouble. Oh, the up he's gone? Is it no it's not enough. It went too low. It's nice like nice uh, little gimp there from Pokeland taking that that next stock. Yeah, that this is like the only villager I've seen with movement like this. It's it's kinda crazy. <laughs> well probably the only villager I've seen in this game for like a long time, <laughs> really. But like since Renai, but like yeah. Rest in peace, Renai. But <laughs> he's got his, a couple spiritual successors, uh, both in Pokolam and uh, players like uh, like Kept. But Pokolam does a lot more dash dancing with Villager than you normally see, which is not usually par for the character's kit. But hey, they make it work, and make it work real good. <laughs> Pokolam plays this character quite fast. Best enough to actually take advantage of. Uh... Axe play where they, whenever they get axe record, like right now, they're just gonna go in and be like, All right, it's time, <laughs> you're playing my game, don't mess up. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, nice, nice. She's no cancel from the tree because I was like, Why are you doing that? I'm like, oh, the tree's still there. <laughs> yeah, that's some full stage awareness and uh, full, absolutely full screen full awareness. Is that gonna, no, 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 not no, quite no, yet. Yeah. 
not, I not thought fast so enough too. to get a bowling ball. Oh wow, I just did the whole thing. And no jump, but Ooh, Villager trade. without his jump is far and away better than more other characters. They're quite vulnerable when they recover with the balloons like that. They're... Oh no, they missed it! The weave. Yeah. The ever so subtle weave. <laughs> you get your ankles broken by Villager all characters? Wow, what a trick. Literally, he <laughs> shattered his ankles. <laughs> Like, well, what are those? <laughs> Just throwing grass all over his <laughs> Tim's, man. No. Like, ah! He's not even wearing shoes. God damn. What a solid game there for Pokeland. Played fast and in your face. There's a lot for Slingshot to hang handle. They traded in a lot of moments when Wait a minute, hold it's on. not good to trade there. Oh, look at that. Can, we, can we run that one again? I want to see the down tilt miss. <laughs> Is there, we're going to be waving around. Yeah, it misses the grab. Oh, that, that loader rocket covered the ledge too, so he can really go dash for out, dash in, miss. Bruh. <laughs> it's like, ah, oh, the shoot. <laughs> Bruh. Oh. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, he tried to go for something again and just simply just do it again. <laughs> it was just so cool, man. That's so tragic. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. <laughs> This character, this character feels like one of the most freestyle characters in this game. You love seeing characters like this. They're very entertaining. And they even stop characters with like strong projectile games too, because like, as you notice that Slingshot has not thrown out a single banana throughout this whole, or peanut, really, as often. They'll, they'll peanut cancel, but they just haven't, like, thrown it out. They don't give Villager anything. Yeah, yeah, that's a that's a really good point. Like they're not trying to have their item used against them, so they're playing just vanilla Diddy Kong buttons only, normals exclusively. Which Diddy, you know, Diddy is fast enough to play this game. It's just I think they're lighter, so they they're not like Lucina. They would just have a good enough upbeat in order to come right in with a disjoint or something and take over the game here, frame trapping and stuff like that. But like. Oh, it throws the band away. Yeah, no, yeah to... smart choice. <laughs> you don't want to give Pokemon anything. Especially when they're free enough to catch it. Still, massive lead right now uh, for Slingshot. And you can start playing to playing to its own advantage. Villager has a pretty decent punish game, at least explored by... Uh, mostly explored by Pokemon, especially with Axe on deck, but... Oh, the turnaround down tilt? That was sick. Pivots? <laughs> Mom Pokemon? Pivot. <laughs> I love seeing good pivot stuff in this game. It's so sick. Uh, super technical stuff like that is really cool to see. I love seeing people know their character in, in and out. Put on a good show for us today at Xeno Wi-Fi Monthly Number Three. If there's an if there's a time to do it, now's that time. Rolls on and clips second hit. Only the second hit, but that's all you need. That's a strong one. Yeah, especially if it, if it helps you win too. Nice forward smash catch from uh, Pokeland. Sometimes you got to take a minute to breathe and think about what you're going to do for this next stock, too. Oh, no tech! That's so much damage for a slingshot. I mean, for a poker. 25. Nothing to sleep on, but hey. hey. Okay, he looked for the reset with the monkey flip. That's, yeah, that's something you got to watch out for. Uh, Pokemon has been... I mean, villager players in general. Like, if you you got that frame 3 Nair, might as well try to break combos. Get yourself some space. Villager certainly likes room to move, room to set up. <laughs> Small little <laughs> back and forth between the players. It's, it's good on also Slingshot to notice that whenever the Lloyd Rockets out, they're just going to jump away instead of engage. Because I wouldn't be engaging with that thing potentially still out there. Like, any move that, like... Or any character that just like has moves that's like potentially out there, like disengaging is also is like the smartest choice you can do. What is like, that I'm doing? <laughs> trying to <laughs> come with theirs. Like nothing. <laughs> yeah, nothing they're doing is working right now. So they got like little potted plants and theirs everywhere. Maybe, maybe get an axe to start like the threatening game again. <laughs> Nair master, look at it. <laughs> it's like the Nair man over here. <laughs> I mean, who's stopping him? <laughs> Not slingshot, that's yeah. for sure. <laughs> I got three out. Oh, whips up smash. Doesn't die for a good DI, good DI. Uh, it's down tilt, it's down tilt. 
trying to weave his way through, but man, Slingshot's showing so much respect, and granted, you kind of have to, but... Ooh, confirms off the down tilt again, but doesn't get the kill. And that, it just seems like it stops confirming right as up smash starts killing, which is a, a shame to be sure, but perhaps he's just a little bit slow on some of his, on, uh, on his dash, not getting enough uh, momentum forward. Still, at 151, anything will start killing now. You just need that one good hit. Yeah. I think fourth throw could do it, too. For Diddy. Near the, near the, near the ledge. But... Yeah, we really haven't been seeing Swingshot go for many grabs. And, yeah. oh, he pays for it there. Committing to the, to the full hop out of the corner. Just called out. Thankfully, three turnips. Yeah, plus those RNG turnips. <laughs> Yeah, good bye, stuff bye. getting rid of the tree, gets rid of the axe as well. It's scary when the thing is just out there. Oh, Poke, I'm just making... He's really taking advantage of Slingshot respecting Ooh. him so much because he can throw out moves that'll clash or, or uh, take space basically for free by not doing anything. You can just walk forward because Slingshot is dashing back so heavily. I look at him, he'll give him space and he'll dash dance around and Pokey Land's like, alright, you know, that's fine, I'll just, just chill over here. Oh, they did they did the most to cover that. That was crazy. It's like they had all the advantage in the world in order to cover that would be. No matter how much they delayed it too. It's good stuff to Pokey Land taking that game as well. Another convincing two stuck. It's all yeah, right. just holding Ooh. on. Holding on, holding steady, and it's it's such a shame to see like a double two stock because or two two stocks thus far because slingshot is playing pretty well he's playing around pokemon's traps not getting hit by most of the like villager things he's just kind of getting like out in a lot of uh, situations where he'll give up space when he's ledge trapping and then die for it or he'll lose uh, he'll win an interaction, take his guaranteed damage, and let Pokemon reset neutral. It's like, yeah, like frame three Nair is scary, but you still have to try and hunt for those kills, especially when they're at 173, or, or else that'll happen. <laughs> yeah. Just going low in that matchup on, on, on recovery for Diddy is just the worst feeling in the world, because Pokemon could literally do anything he wants in order to cover any attempt at coming back. So let's see if Slingshot can avoid that situation and play a more stage game and get advantage, potentially take a game here. They have the buttons, they have the speed. Diddy is, is a good enough character to fight uh, Villager. Yeah, the, the tools are there. It's and yet, well, yet again, the execution, you shore up a little bit of your, a little bit of your kill setups. Try not to let Pokemon give you kills. And, you know, this game can be convincingly taken. Yeah, Axe on deck. Solid starter. Axe on deck for real, man. Yeah. <laughs> Slingshot is waiting out the tree. Yes, there it goes. Yeah, like, once it starts going away there. Take advantage of the time to go in. Especially when Lloyd Rocket is summoned. Probably go out there and land on a button on him before. Potentially uh, trading with Poke Lamb before they come in or something. High recovery and reasonable choice. <laughs> Careful the aggro. Oh. oh, nice use of the nair right there. Very ambiguous as where that was going to hit. Coming down with buttons and then we see it again. No, he looks for backer this time. The minute. Uh, differences between interactions is w what is going to give Slingshot the space he needs to start to close out stocks. Down to but misses the grab is too high. Oh, More dash dancing for very, players. Yeah. This is the closest I've seen their stocks like go. <laughs> it's like it's been two minutes essentially. <laughs> but for not committing to too much dangerous moves here. Oh wait, the jab. All right. Just waiting for one person to get. You get the person off stage and then take advantage of their edge guard situation. Very close for both players. 
F tilt, dash in, out, back, forth. Banana out for once, but oh, there it goes. Back throw? Smush choice and slingshot for throwing it away. They would have gotten confirmed and it would. Oh, nice. And he, nice. And he weaved it onto the platforms, but the up smash clanged, <laughs> clanged yeah. with forward air and we're back again to neutral. <laughs> Try to hit with the, uh, that turnaround down tilt again, but they just simply were just whiffing right in front of them. <laughs> oh, no, they'll jump. Oh, okay. Monkey flip. What a great tool to come back on the stage with. Exclusive to Diddy Kong. Oh, no. Yeah. Finally, after like a good three minutes of neutral right there. Wow, that was so smart. Using the forward smash on the tree in order to extend it. You said neutral. You want more of it? Cause yeah, because we're been, about to get it. <laughs> it's been three minutes. And, uh, I mean, Pokemon's got a pretty substantial lead now, but percent differentials kind of... And they come and go as they please. Man, bowling ball makes you scared. Yeah. <laughs> I want to get uh, grabbed by a character with such a long recovery on their throw animation. Talking about Villager. But, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Flipping through, this is a punch. Yeah, you're getting axed. No matter where you go there, that's kind of a free axe. He's, he's going to chop you up and look for look for yet another couple chops if he has the chance. Uh, sapling not on the stage, so Oops. still a full setup needs for Pokemon if he chooses to go for it. No, he's just calling out monkey flips. <laughs> that's what he was waiting for, but the elf smash barely whiffing. Got to space your moves right, and there's, I guess there's that blind spot that Diddy's uh, small size can fit right through. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Again, even in stocks again, Monkey Flip proved to be advantageous here. Forward arrows and arrows are all connecting. Slingshot doing a good job trying to take this lead back. Keeping the fight to poke land. Oh, but one snipe from the forward air taking the stock. She's going to pull up Banana here. They're obviously not going to get it as fast and easily as Pokemon's ready just to catch it. So there's like little to like no fear to just to have it in your hand, but... Just... It could be used for some like weird misdirection. Like you... Like, like, think of snake grenades getting absorbed by like Ness, for instance, where it's just like, here it is, but I'm not going to hit you with it. <laughs> yeah, it's just something on the screen that you'll have to consider. But my true game plan it lies elsewhere. Yeah. You need, gotta camouflage your intentions somehow. Some approaching can be rather committal in this game, given uh, the uh, that initial dash is uh, much more committal overall. Not being able to shield out of it. But uh, yeah, and I feel like that theory like applies to villager as well as it, as they put a lot of things for setup and like abilities for the character, but like, you just like, forget about it. It's not hitting you. Elf Smash to catch the, the landing, and Pokelam takes it. Simply takes it. Yeah, I mean, that's... As the set progressed, we saw... Uh, we only saw Slingshot provide more and more respect onto Pokelam. Like, he would take stocks, which is, which is great, but it would take so much longer. Games would go so much longer. Ooh. And Pokalam, in the meantime, only got more and more space to be able to start looking to snipe things like Monkey Flip and snipe things like uh, Landing Aerials, which is exactly what he did. Yeah, it's good stuff. All right, so moving on to the last match of Winner's Quarters, we're going to have Sassy Flygon and Six of Swords. And we just see that the Macharino has just hit $50. Woo! -hoo! Sick. Yeah! Pop off, Devin. <laughs> Hit every button on your on your soundboard real quick. All of them, at once. Guys, if we still have... No, yeah, exactly. <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, okay, so... If we still have coupon codes to, to give out for you guys in order to donate those free 50 cents...